point. So we lost our connection, but we got to keep going on with the story because uh, if you saw the first part, you're going to want to see this part because I'm waiting for the answer. I don't know it. So, you know, I, I mentioned that, uh, so that line in the movie, hey, oh, oh, you're come on, you're dead you're yet? Dead. You know, did you have any kind of scary moments? I mean, well, come on. No, look, man, every, every, if, so everybody remembers that crash from 1980 in the Olympics. That was my seventh crash <laughs> for the season. So did I have any scary moments? And look, my, my first ride in a bobsled was one of the scariest times of my life, you know what I mean? And I just oh honestly, my. I resigned myself. I remember saying, you know, if I die, I die. But I was going to go, right? And then my first crash was probably two weeks after that. I was a brain man at the time, so I wasn't oh driving. And, and yeah, it's, it's like you kind of end up in the twilight zone and then it <laughs> just goes crazy with fiberglass burning and the, the sound of the sled scraping on the ice. Oh, yeah, gosh. how about some scary movies? <laughs> So let me ask you this, what are the other guys doing now? So um, you know, Michael Wilder is in Long Island, he works in retail. Chris Stokes is in Jamaica, he's, in, he's an entrepreneur. So he's in financial services and some other businesses. And Dundas Stokes, our, our driver, our illustrious captain, he lives on the church and King Island. I think he's a customs broker. Oh, okay. Company, yeah, so. And you're being a motivational speaker, so hey, those guys that know me, and you know, when I'm not available, or you need that, there's a man. Hey, There's man. a man. A motivational speaker, author of, of a, a not for profit. But yeah, in fact, we could probably tag team too. Uh, you know what? We're looking forward. We're going to make that happen. We're going to tag team, baby. We're going to tag team. I like teamanship. So let me, hey, here's a crazy question Did you guys make any money from the movie? So we, are, we, we got some money up front. But the real money was supposed to come afterwards. But our friends at Disney said the movie didn't make a profit. Well, oh, yeah. Exactly. Oh, yeah. You know, Pinocchio's nose is like a mile <laughs> long right now, man. So we, I heard some rumors, don't know, yeah. I heard some rumors, maybe there might be a cool running too. Well, this time you go a little different on the contract. Well, yeah, yeah, you know, <laughs> you know that cool, cool runnings was a very expensive lesson. So if it does happen that we end up with a cool running store, the more informed. Okay, you know, this is probably totally unfair or crazy. Absolutely crazy. I did movies in 83. I was in Uncommon Valor with Gene Hackman and Patrick Swayze. I was in um, The Jagged Edge with Jeff Bridges and Glenn Close. You know, I still get money from those films. See how that is? You don't get any money? Nothing. Not a dime. Not I, a I dime. think Cool Running, I don't know. I mean, these are pretty big movies I was in. Dude. But I think that was huge. I still get When was that come out? When did that come out? 93. Like my movie, that I, those movies that I was in in 83, I'm still getting 10 years money early, right? I've, I've been to Japan, I've been to Europe, I've seen the movie on TV. Oh my I get, gosh. I don't get a dime. Oh my gosh. Yeah, well, you know, that, that's how it is. Well, you know what? You changed my life. That movie is still Thank one of my favorites. I'm going to go back and see it again. And next time I get paid from Jagged Edge, I'm going to send it over to you because you get it. Oh, you deserve yeah, it. Yeah, we, 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 we need to love this play for you. Ah, so it's just fantastic, man. Hey, dude, Great to know awesome. you. And yep. I can't wait to share a stage with you, actually. Uh, We're gonna, I'm going to invite you to something. We got to be a ball. So, Two kind of here. If you missed the first Facebook Live, we just continued on because we're still here in Hollywood at uh, the Secret Knock event. And uh, I know you hear a lot of noise. Hope you can hear me. I mean, that's, but go back and see the first one because this man is what created or the thought of this whole movie concept of Cool Running. And if you've never seen Cool Running, it is a must. It is a must. I haven't even thought about that movie in years. Sure. But oh, I had such a ball, and I can't wait to go see it again. Thank you, my friend. Oh, awesome. Thank you.